Hey everyone, it's Vicki Marie, and uh, today I'm going to do a Walmart haul, uh, my weekly Walmart haul. And now, recently, I hit a milestone. <laughs> so, I am really excited um, to cross the 1,000 subscriber uh, milestone because I honestly, when I started, I didn't even know what all that meant. I just saw Lori FNM Lifestyle vlogging one day and I was just so moved by how real and authentic she was and I knew that's what I wanted to do. Um, you know, I've done some, a little bit of everything here on my vlog uh, and I have playlists, so if you like a particular type of video, um, it's pretty easy to find. I'm also adding chapters to my descriptions now. So like today, if you wanna skip all the chit chat and just look at the haul, just go to the chapters uh, down below in the description or just scroll across. I've got it so you can just scroll right over to the Walmart pickup haul today. Like I am getting ready to go to the gym. It's a gym day. I'm going to Planet Fitness Amino Energy. I'm putting a scoop of this in my water bottle. I love this watermelon flavor. Okay, so for breakfast, I'm going to make myself a mashed up banana and I take a half of banana I, I mash it up in my, my, my bullet, and then I add some fruit if I have it. Um, I am out of blackberries. Uh, oh, darn it. I think, gosh, I need to order more blackberries. I had eight minutes left to add to my Walmart order, so I added some blackberries and I added four plums. So now I've got to feed Roscoe because poor thing, I'm neglecting him. I'm sitting here chatting with you and he's hungry. All right, so this week in the food plan, just talking about food planning, um, we're actually, our, some of our, our couple, well, uh, some really good friends of ours just got back from Italy. They were there for four weeks, and we're having dinner with them on Friday or Saturday night uh, to catch up with them, hear about their trips. They have a new grandbaby, super excited to see pictures. Um, and then that's Saturday night, Friday night, uh, this goes out Friday morning, I'm filming on Thursday. So, um, so tomorrow night for me, Friday night, we're, we're going out to meet some other friends. They are camping near the water and we're just gonna drive out for the evening and have a steak fry. So that's what we're eating, kind of out, eating out two nights in a row there. And then we have a big project Saturday morning we're going to be working on. Uh, I'll share more about that. I am starved, I love this for breakfast. So, super easy. Okay, now I'm just gonna take the lid off and here's what makes it so good. Uh, I'm gonna chop this half of a banana up and mix that in with the blended banana strawberry yogurt mixture, just for some texture. Sometimes I add blackberries, sometimes I add a couple of pecans or walnuts, but I'm not gonna do that today. So that's it, just stir it up. Let me just blend it kind of mix it this is so good and if you like ice cream like I do this is almost like I mean this is just good and it's one of those things that when I eat it my body just goes oh thank you thank you mm. all right I'm gonna finish eating this and I'll check back in with you guys um, when I get in the I'm car. here at Walmart just picked up my Walmart grow, uh, pickup order for the week and I'm gonna take you guys uh, back to the house and we're gonna take a look at what I bought. I did leave the gym uh, a little bit ago, went and had coffee with my friend Melinda, and, um, and I did go to TJ Maxx. <laughs> so I'm not gonna uh, do that video mixed with my Walmart haul. I'm gonna separate them out. That way if you guys are here for the Walmart haul, that's what you're gonna see today. And then if you wanna see the TJ Maxx haul, um, that will be coming out next oh, and week. By the way, our plan of fitness is doing a deal so since school is out for for teens 14 to 18 I think you can actually they get to work out for free over the summer and so if you have a plan of fitness near you you might check it out and see if they're offering that in your area I sent that to my sister because she's got three teens in that age group at home and she said, oh that's that's really good to know so uh, yeah so I was excited so between 14 and, no, 14 and 19, I think. I think it's 14 and 19 is the age that they're offering free. Like you can work, those, those uh, school age kids can go work out for free at the gym. So I just think that's a great deal. Well, I'm gonna get back to the house here and I will show you uh, what I picked up in the Walmart pickup today. So here's my haul, y'all. 
And let's do the chicken first so I can get that put away. I, uh, boneless, skinless, and 681. And this is 1.52 pounds. This is plenty for John and me for a couple, probably three meals. Let me put that away real quick. And these are upside down, but these are a staple at my house for m myself. I eat these for my little treats. They're the fudge pops. Uh, you guys see them almost every week on my haul. So I did buy another pack of those. Three are in a serving. I'll have two to three every couple of nights. And yep, I never want to run out. Those things are, uh, they taste wonderful. Now those uh, fudge pops are $4.64 each and there's a nine, 18 in, in each pack. Uh, but yeah, $4.64. Okay, I got two avocados. They were uh, $1.28 each and they're actually pretty soft. Um, they're, I mean, not super soft, but they're a little bit soft. So I would say they're perfect. They really did a good job uh, picking that out, I think. I spent $1.55 for two sweet potatoes, and these things are so good. I had one from, well, I bought a couple last week, and I showed you guys a few days ago. I had a, uh, we, we cooked a sweet potato out on the, uh, had it with our steak. I had a sweet potato. I cut it up. I had just a little bit of butter, and I always use real butter. I don't use the margarine or anything. I, it's always real butter, um, except for the spray butter. The I cannot, I can't believe it's butter, the spray butter. I use that sometimes, but most of the time I use real butter in my baking and things like that. So real butter with 100% maple syrup instead of brown sugar oh my gosh it is the best so i love these i could eat these twice a, a week three times a week and then on top of that i could also eat french fries i love sweet potato fries but these are probably a little healthier can't eat the maple syrup every night but i gotta tell you that was such a good combination now the blackberries were 298 for each package and their blackberries are really, really good. That's for six ounces, uh, so I bought two packs. And I really enjoy these. And I do rinse them, and then I store them in a plastic bag, but I don't seal the bag. I put them in a Ziploc bag, seal the Ziploc bag, and I cut off just a little bit of the corner so it's not completely sealed. And they will last several days um, in the fridge, and I eat them pretty quick. Now these oranges were six twenty-eight, six dollars and twenty-eight cents for a four-ounce bag of oranges. Uh, that was a little bit high, but it's what I got. I did get the organic. Um, I really love oranges, and I, my plan is to chop these up, and I I blend some banana, make a little smoothie banana base, and then I add chopped fruit in it and a little bit of yogurt. It is so good. Um, I also will cut some of these up for the Orioles, but the Orioles aren't eating much, the birds. They they do like, uh, I hear they like orange slices, but they're not messing with my orange slices, so we'll see what happens. Now, I ended up with two bags of baby carrots. No, no, just one, no, two bags. Yep, here's the other bag. And so these were 98 cents each for uh, these baby carrots and I was a little disappointed because we like the carrot chips we've really been enjoying the carrot chips but we could not get any this week they gave us these instead so that's gonna have to do but I tell you what we we love the the chips the carrots uh, the the like I got last week I wish we could have gotten more uh, I'm definitely gonna be looking for uh, for those in the store super good but we've got these for now high in vitamin A and you know that's good for our skin and our eyes and that's what I'm doing is trying to eat healthy get my nutrition helping out that skin and all of that those changes from oh you know being a woman my age now the bananas I paid a dollar 21 and I did get that was for six of them and these are the Del Monte and I got to tell you these Del Monte bananas are so sweet I just have to let them ripen a little bit, but they are so sweet and yummy. I got uh, some Chiquita bananas the other day. I just stopped at the little Save-A-Lot down the street, um, and they were Chiquita ban bananas. They were not near as good as these. So let me know if you guys are if you're banana fans, where are you buying your bananas, and what's your favorite? Do you notice a difference? Because I definitely noticed a difference. Now, I paid $5.43 for 32 ounces of this Chobani Greek yogurt non-fat. I love this stuff. I put a couple of tablespoons, two to three tablespoons in with my mashed up banana. I mix that with fruit, chopped up fruit, some uh, nuts. Sometimes I grind some nuts up and 
Oh, it is so good, and I had that almost every morning for breakfast. $3.68 for, um, these are 11.5 ounces each, one sugar, one's not, uh, no sugar, and these are our creamers. You guys see these every week. $3.12 for Ken's Steakhouse Light Balsamic vinaigrette. vinaigrette. We really like this, that's for 16 ounces. And yep, we really like this, it's a staple at our house. $2.24 for this Classico tomato and basil, one pound, uh, one pound eight ounce uh, jar. Another staple at our house. We love this stuff. Now these were $3.28 each, and, and this stuff has good protein in it. So it's just chicken meat with no antibiotics, 98% fat free, no added MSG, and it's got 15 grams of protein per three ounce serving. So I do like to eat this. Um, and I like to keep it on the shelf in my, my pantry, trying to get enough protein into my diet. These were $2.48 each for these uh, seeds of change. This is organic brown rice, and um, that's for 8.5 ounces. One pouch, one serving. So, you know, it's better if you can just get a big box of, of, of rice, but for us, we're empty nesters. Um, that will be plenty, and um, that's what we're gonna. I, I like those. I can. I usually just stick them in the instant pot uh, with whatever meat we're eating, and that's enough for us. Sometimes I have that, and John has mashed potatoes, so it works out really, really well. These plums were three dollars for. Oops, for four of them. Hmm, starting to juggle there, and they're really, really good. I've had them uh, before, and uh, I, first I put them in the fridge, and I've learned not to do that, so I just put them in my fruit basket with my bananas and apples and oranges and they they uh, ripen really nice and they're juicy and I've really enjoyed those. And then here's my non-food items. So this was $19.47 for a 20 pound bag and I could do cheaper than that I'm sure at Tractor Supply Company but I wasn't going to get over there so I decided to go ahead and pick some up. And this is the premium squirrel food, the 3D uh, pet products. And yep, it's just got the corn, the seeds, and a few peanuts in there. Now these were uh, $4.94. They're the wet mopping cloths, lavender, the Febreze. I really like these. I use them with my Swifter. I still use my big mop, uh, but this one, you know, my Swifter just comes in handy for just quick cleanups. And I just love this scent. So I also use this in our camper which uh, we're going to be getting the camper ready for a trip coming up, so um, I like to have these on hand. Now this was $6.97, and I like this. It's a gallon of the Mr. Clean Antibacterial um, Summer Citrus. I uh, just wanted to have some on hand. I'm gonna be cleaning up the camper. I'm gonna be, you know, just, I just use this for everyday cleaning. I like to put a little bit in my sink uh, with some hot water and I use that to wipe everything down. This was $13.68 and this is for the pedigree. I get this all the time for Roscoe. These just really, really, he, he likes them. Um, he hasn't gotten tired of them and I've been able to consistently get them. So this is why I, I did switch a while back to this, but it's been, it's been a winner with him. So, and that's for 63 ounces. There's 18 little packs, 3.5 each. And it does have chicken and beef. And I got some pine saw, and this was $3.78. I did get some pine glow from Dollar Tree, but it just is not as, as foamy and good as this, and it just doesn't have quite the same scent to me. Um, so I prefer this if I can get it. And this was 48 full ounces. So again, that was $3.78. And that's my haul, y'all. And my meal plan's very loose because I'm an empty nester, and it's all about being flexible for us because we do sometimes unexpectedly eat out, and we, we have fun. We don't have kids at home anymore. We don't have grandkids yet. We're sort of in that sweet spot where we can be really, really selfish with our time and not feel guilty, and I'm enjoying it. Who knows what the future will hold, but right now, we have time freedom. So my meal plans are very, very loose, but I am trying to stay off high blood pressure, or blood pressure medicine, and you know, that's my goal. I'll keep you guys posted on that. Let me know in the comments how you're doing. I'm filming it on Thursday, 
This will go out Friday, so woohoo, it's the weekend. Let me know what you got planned for the weekend, and let me know how you're doing on your meal plan and, and what you got any ideas for me for, for my meal plan. I'm always looking for just new ideas, simple ideas, because I don't want to spend a ton of time in the kitchen anymore. <laughs> Oh, well, on special occasions, but for the most part, my routine does not include a lot of time in the kitchen. So thank you guys so much for your love and support, and I, I just appreciate it so much. I will be coming out with a, an announcement coming up. I do have an appreciation giveaway that I will talk more about. I just want to make sure that I kind of stick with that 1,000 plus because, um, you know, YouTube... Give it and YouTube take it away sometimes. You just, you never know. So I'm just gonna let it stick for a couple of weeks and then I will be coming out with a um, appreciation giveaway. Stay tuned for that. Thank you so much for watching and for the support. Uh, take good care. I will see you on the next one. Bye.